Morning. Morning. So, sorry, you carry on. That was, <laughs> just start that again. It's Sunday morning. That's seamless. <laughs> Sunday morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. It's Sunday morning and we've just started the West Highland Way. Well, we started yesterday, but only just. Kind of. Kind of. A little bit. But it's backwards. We're going backwards. Are we? <laughs> I'm walking forwards. Okay, so. Good. That's how it is. <laughs> good. So, oh, I mean, been a long trip so far with me. We're on the last leg of our Three Scots Way. We've made that name up, that's not. That's good if there is a Three Scots Way, uh, apologies. <laughs> we weren't aware of it at the time of recording. Uh, so, spent, uh, so, what did we do yesterday? Into Fort William, uh, had something to eat in Fort William, avoided the rain, great. It's got me heavy again yesterday. Yeah. Uh, then stopped at a place called Ashanty House last night, which was lovely. very nice. Lovely views of Ben Nevis. Literally on the bottom of the hill of Ben Nevis. Yeah, perfect. Um, seen quite a lot of people. I think Clive have just about to start climbing the mountain today. Uh, it's been a bit, bit of low cloud this morning. Quite misty. Uh, a bit, yeah, a bit misty. But it's dry, which is good. And we're sort of starting the West Highland Way proper today so yeah into about 16 miles ish today probably through King Lock Leven uh, and then camp somewhere beyond I think this evening uh, that's, it. that's it really not got much else useful to say see you later see you later seamless intro. Uh, so, a bit of misty this morning. Um, 
But yesterday was a wonderful day. Great walk. Oh, um, yeah, we walked all the way through Glencoe yesterday. Um, started in Kinglock Leven. That was a fairly long, steep climb out of there. And then down Devil Staircase, which isn't as bad as it's far less ominous than the name suggests. <laughs> um, much less than the walk up from Kinglock Leven. Um, so I think we did about 18 miles or so yesterday. Um, we yeah. stopped in Inverlen. In Inverroran, we stopped at, yep, yeah, just wild camped and then had a nice meal at the um, pub slash hotel just down the road, which is very nice. We woke up in the mist this morning, this is the first time there's been mist around the tent, usually you have to walk into the hills a bit, but it was fully misty. Yeah, very misty this morning, still misty now, can't really see very much. We've um, just walked through Bridge of Orkey. Yep. And we're on the way to Tindrum. On the way to Tindrum and the plan is to do, I don't know, 14, 15 ish miles today. So a bit less than yesterday, less elevation gain and loss. Um, yeah, at the minute, not a great deal to see. Lovely green mountains and fields and trees, as always. Yes. Of but nothing, no spectacular Glencoe mountain type thing. No, or well, nothing yet. that we can see at the moment, but um, the forecast is good, so hopefully it will lift, lift a bit um, in the next couple of hours or so. Um, and we get a good day. Do you want to repeat that? <laughs> repeat what you just said off there? <laughs> you said you're good because you are good, Mr. Goonahoon. Thanks. Come. <laughs> That's it. <laughs> That's it. Take the tent That's down. Right. We're going home. So, anyway, it's good evening. Tuesday evening, and we are, I think, camped just above Crinlaric. We are. Crinlaric. In Have you shown them the beautiful scenery? It's beautiful scenery. We've camped right on the top of, like, on the edge of the woods on the top. It's really pretty. Been sunny today. Been sunny since about 11ish. It's been very warm. The mist arose, and yes, very really hot. It's the hottest day we've had. Actually, Definitely. we stopped off and had some lunch in the hottest part of the day because it was really hot. And then something really cool happened. Slash, not very cool, but um, so there was some issues and there was a helicopter so a helicopter was coming over which we thought was, everybody thought was really cool and we were sitting outside and it seemed really cool until all of a sudden the helicopter started to descend and the wind blew everywhere the everything off the tables blew everywhere james's massive bag blew away <laughs> It was a bit of an interesting lunch. That was uh, Tindrum. Yeah, got was some, nice. got some more supplies. Um, yeah, we had a couple of hours there. It's a nice little mm. pit stop. Um, then we've walked through the woods this afternoon, and we are camped just above, yeah, just above Crinlaric. It's a little bench here, which is very convenient. And I think we've done about six, what is it, sixteen miles today? Mm, about fifteen and a half, sixteen miles. Yeah. Something like that, and I think probably about the same tomorrow. About 16 miles tomorrow, we'll camp somewhere down Loch Lomond tomorrow, is the plan. Uh, it should be another very hot day, apparently, so we're going to start fairly early, I think, to try and avoid the hottest part of the day. Um, but certainly makes a change from the rain. Mm, we like this better than rain. This is much better. So until tomorrow, or whenever we can be bothered to record another <laughs> one of these.
Till next time. Goodbye. Hello. <laughs> so it's our uh, last night tonight. We are camping next to Loch Lomond on the side. We've been walking past Loch Lomond most of today. Not the longest day in terms of miles, I think about 16. Mm. Um, but quite a, quite a long drag down the side of Loch Lomond. Very rocky. We bumped into a couple of people that told us, warned us about the rockiness, and they were right. It was like, clambering over bits and up and down. Yeah. It's Safe and fine, but just a bit. Just slow, just yeah. slow going up all around all the craggy bits. Um, but wonderful day, mm. just so sunny. perfectly sunny and it's been mirror calm on the lock all day. There's been people out on speedboats and jet skis enjoying themselves. Mm. Um, yeah, yeah, very warm. We arrived in the woods behind us. Um, near the Bothy, Rowish Bothy. Yep. Um, and decided not to go in the Bothy, so we sort of followed the hill down, and we are camped literally just behind us, and we're sat on a little beachy bit at the moment. Um, the reason my hair is so crazy <laughs> is because we decided, because it was so hot and we were a little bit hot and sweaty, that we would get into the lock. So we've had a good old clean in the lock. Yep, had a nice wash. Cleaned my hair to a certain extent. Good. Not really clean, but it's got a lovely crinkle look to it. <laughs> yeah, it's been... But it's it's been fresher a, than it was. <laughs> a hot, sweaty day. Um, but really nice. Yeah. Um, and yes, our last night, a very, very pretty area. Sat by the lock, watching mm. the sun go down at the moment. Um, and tomorrow we've got I think about 18 miles or so left down the end of Loch Lomond and over Conic Hill and then we'll be back in Drummond. Drummond. So it'll be our last last day tomorrow. That's um, a big one to end with. Yeah, so I think we'll get an early start probably. Yes. Um, but we do know we're booked into a B&B so there will be Treats. showers, etc. Although there's a, a four, 4 o'clock till 6 o'clock window of being able to check in so we need to make sure that we leave and get there early Not enough. a problem, we're definitely going to get there. Yeah, we're going to get there. Uh, <laughs> so yeah, so last day tomorrow, uh, and that's it. Nearly 300 miles done. 300 miles in less than three weeks. The yeah. three tours we, the three Scots tours we, the three Scots <laughs> we. <laughs> that was great. That's a different name, that's three different names. No, it is. The three Scots we, today is the last night of the three Scots we. And the accent? It's copying off of Big Brother Man. <laughs> Climb yourself. Climb me bad self. Okay. Can't be Scottish. I just can't no, be Scottish. Pretty confusing. Scottish. Pretty, <laughs> pretty confusing uh, end there. So, well, that's us. Uh, that, that's probably, probably our last little chat, I expect. Oh, but it's been lovely. It has and we've been had lovely. a lovely three weeks. And Very nice. Although most people think it's mental that we've decided for a holiday that we do 300 miles around in three weeks around Scotland on the free Scots Wii. Um, it has been very good. 
Thank you. Is that a Newcastle accent? Yeah, of course it's Geordie. Okay. <laughs> Great. Makes sense. Okay. See you later. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> Finished. And that's us done. Four o'clock on Thursday. Job done, driven, in the sun. It is really sunny today. That's it. Woo. See you later.